Hi everyone, I'm Dr. David Reith and I'm here to talk about this week's Truth to Meter Tuesday question. Well, the question was sort of stimulated by watching the Oscars last Sunday. And as I said, there's always a lot of buzz about the dresses and a lot of buzz about plastic surgery. And unfortunately, the buzz about the latter is not always good. So it got me thinking about what people like to see as the results from plastic surgery, and is it different from the face as it might be for the body? So I asked you to respond to this question, and many of you did, and had some very great responses, that what people are looking for in terms of facial rejuvenation, face, uh, uh, operations to help with facial aging, are results that are subtle. Whereas what people are looking for in terms of results from working on the body, we're talking primarily breasts and abdomen, is people want results that are not as subtle. They want them to be more obvious, a more significant and definite change. And what the responses that all of you gave me were definitely everybody's looking for subtle results in the face, and I would agree with that. The goal in the face is to make you look like yourself, but make you look a little bit younger. So the results from that standpoint can be subtle. The opinions were sort of divided about results in the body, whether to be subtle or to be obvious. And I will tell you from where I sit, talking to most of my patients, the patients in terms of their body want a definite result. They want to see a change, and usually a significant change. But I would agree that what people are looking for is a normal contour to their body, such that if you take somebody and you're uh, putting breast implants in and they look too, too big, that's a really obvious change. That's not what people are looking for. But getting a change in the shape of the breast, shape of the abdomen that undoes things that have happened as a result of weight loss or the result of pregnancies or things of this nature, then I think we are looking for a significant change, but we want the body to look well proportioned. We don't want it to look out of balance or, you know, just weird. So I think that everybody's probably saying about the same thing and saying it in a little different way, which is very interesting, and I really appreciate you all for responding to this. But let's find out who this week's winner is. Christine Moyers. Christine, congratulations. You're this week's winner. We have a $100 gift card for you, so come on in and pick that up. And for everyone else, thanks for playing. Enjoy the sunshine. Have another question for you next week.